Yes, and we are just three days away from the Iowa caucus. On Monday, primary voting kicks off in the state, and as the Iowa caucus goers cast their ballots for their party's nominee. ABC News' Rachel Bade breaks down the process that often confuses even political junkies. It's been a time-honored tradition in the Hawkeye State for a century. Iowans gathered in school gymnasiums and church basements to haggle out political matters and jumpstart the process of choosing their party's presidential nominee. Unlike most primaries, where voters cast ballots at polling centers and quickly leave, Iowans seclude themselves in a large community room, sometimes for hours before making their decision. Starting at 7 p.m. Central, Iowans will gather in one of these nearly 1,700 precinct locations. They'll listen as representatives from the various campaigns try to persuade the room to back their candidate. Then the peer pressure begins. Surrounded by friends and neighbors, sometimes hundreds of people, Iowans engage in an 11th-hour lobbying effort to sway attendees to back their candidate. Any Iowan can register to vote or change their party affiliation on caucus day, meaning Democrats could vote in a GOP race, creating an air of unpredictability. Following deliberations, voters will write their candidate's name on a blank sheets of paper. The secret ballot process expected to be quickly tabulated and submitted electronically to the state party. This kind of system certainly benefits campaigns that have developed infrastructure that are geared at getting folks to show up on caucus night to be caucus leaders, right? You kind of need somebody in that gymnasium who's going to rally support for your guy or your girl on caucus night. History showing that the Iowa caucuses don't necessarily predict the party's eventual nominee. Yet state officials priding themselves on narrowing the field. An ABC News politics website, 538, finding that the Iowa winner often receives a polling bounce. Iowa and New Hampshire do not go first because they are important. They are important because they go first. So these early wins are absolutely crucial for focusing attention, getting branded as a winner, and being able to fundraise so that you can make it all the way to June. Well, it's going to be a bitter cold day for caucus goers. Temperatures are not expected to go above zero on Monday, meaning some Iowa voters will embrace the dangerous conditions when making their choice. Now, it could end up being the coldest caucus day ever.